new tonight at 6. For the first time since being named acting attorney general, Matt Whitaker spoke in Des Moines today. He gave two speeches, the first on elder abuse and justice. Local 5 Sabrina Ahmed reports. Acting U.S. Attorney Matt Whitaker is a Des Moines native. He was here in Des Moines today speaking at two different events. The first focused on elder abuse, and he actually gave a personal narrative speaking about his own family that lives in Ankeny and a situation that happened with his mother. Take a listen. My own mother in Ankeny, Iowa, has received calls that were allegedly from my oldest son asking for help to get out of jail. We all know these happen, and it's heartbreaking when your own mother calls you to ask if your son or daughter is really in jail and needs help. Whitaker recognized both the northern and southern districts of Iowa for their work in prosecuting those who do commit elder abuse crimes. At the second event that he attended, he spoke with local law enforcement officials about the opioid epidemic and violent crimes with opioid abuse. He touted the Trump administration's progress in decreasing the number of violent crimes across the country, as well as fighting the opioid epidemic, and promised to continue to do that. Now, at both of these events, the press was not allowed to ask Matt Whitaker any questions and in the second event we were only there to attend seven minutes of that meeting. Reporting from Des Moines, I'm Sabrina Ahmed, Local 5 News, we are Iowa. A congressional leaders are talking about Whitaker's position now that he's been on the job for about a week. Senator Joni Ernst says she trusts him.